I suppose have some games. All right, welcome back to Clash of Peabody Garage. Well, it is time to move the 83. This truck's been sitting here since about December of uh, 2012, so that makes it about uh, five, six months. Uh, I don't see why it wouldn't start right up, just because this thing has been so reliable for me every single time I want to use it. However, the battery has been out of it. It's all full of full of spider webs. A little bit of rust is formed on the pulleys. No big deal. Uh, but what I'm doing, check out my last video. Uh, I got a new addition coming to Classic G Body Garage. And what I want to do is I want to park it right next to. There's Moby. Seeing what I'm up to. I want to park it right next to uh, these other three cutlasses here. So just going to fire this thing up and uh, park it right behind uh, the other two cutlasses here. So just going to gas it up. Got to prime this thing every time I start it just because the, uh, the fuel bowl likes to leak down. Common problem with these quadra jets once these, you know, when these things sit. And I have no idea if this, there's even gas in this truck. So we'll go ahead and uh, hook up the battery and see if it fires up. Carb is primed, battery's hooked up. Let's see what happens. Hopefully Moby's out of the way. I got a seat in here. Ugh, I got a couple of seat in here. Get the hell out of the way. Yeah, it looks like it has a little bit of gas. I don't know if that's accurate though. I thought it had less gas than that. Oh. Gas gets going down now. Fires right up every time. Been sitting since December 2012. Come on. Doesn't like to stay running. Running smooth as ever. Look at Moby's eating a bird. Moby, you leave that bird alone. Moby! All right, I don't want him to get that bird. That's a mama bird. Moby, leave that bird alone. Well, there's the bird right there that Moby was getting. It appears it's a little baby robin. That little thing, first time flying, and Moby's already going after him. Looks like he's okay. I think he's just scared and hiding. That's Mama Bird yelling at me, yelling at Moby. I don't know what happened to that little baby. That little baby ran inside the wood pile somewhere, so I just hope it's okay. Moby loves to get mice, but I hate when he gets birds. I don't mind when he gets those mice. All right, well, let's fire this thing back up and get this truck moved. Oh shit! A little fun demolition derby here. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, you gotta have a little bit of fun with these junk cars, right? Have a little backyard demolition derby. Boy, I barely even hit this thing, and look what it did to it. It pushed that quarter panel way in. Then again, there's not a whole lot of reinforcement back there just because the amount of rust this car has. Well, hey, I needed to move this car anyways and make a little bit of room for what's coming up. So, well, welcome back to Class G Body. That is what is showing up. That is the latest addition to Classic G Body Garage. It is a 1980 Cutlass Supreme. I think this guy's going to try to back it in. 
I'm not sure what he's going to do here. I think he's just moving over. Well, we'll get it unloaded and see what it looks like. Want me to hop up inside? Yep. Going down. Well, we got it down off the truck. Dropped it down with the winch. This car looks very clean overall, but we'll see uh, We'll see what it looks like up close once we get it in the driveway. He's gonna help me push it in the driveway, and uh, I'll show you guys exactly what it looks like. Okay.